All right, welcome back. Nigerian activist Adenyoju Deji reveals two governors that have openly spoken against insecurity. All right, the news in details. Popular Nigerian activist Adenyoju has revealed two Nigerian governors that have only that have openly spoken against the high rate of insecurity in the country and also has applauded them for their courage and strength. Adenyoju disclosed that only two sitting governors out of the 36 have spoken on the security crisis in the country. Adenyoju disclosed that the two governors have aggressively voiced their opinion on social media and in the press. All right, according to Adenyoju on his verified Twitter handle, he has said that, well, among 36 governors, only Wiki and Autumn are talking as the country burns. Everyone else is acting like all is well. All right, and on to this, it has been said that the rate of killings, kidnapping, and uh, terrorism has increased in the past few months in the country, and two governors have reacted to the recent development. The governors are River State Governor Yeson Wiki. All right, and then he has on several occasions called out President Muhammad Buhari criticizing his inability to handle the insecurity crisis in the country. Governor of River State, Wiki Yesom Nzewo, made open that Nigeria has failed to be a country and has collapsed due to insecurity and terrorism. He also went ahead to tell the president of Nigeria to resign or do the needful. Governor Wiki also has been in opposition to President Buhari and his administration. He has been speaking out about the insecurity and several killings going on in the country. All right, also people have applauded the governor of Benue State, Samuel Autumn, for speaking without fear and uh, pointing out the wrongs of President Buhari. He made it known that the president working with the Fulanese to destroy this country. He has been a lion in this period, calling out the president severally for his incapability of ruling the country. He also has called the president to resign that he has ruined the country and has completely collapsed it. All right, and then until this, a lot of people have been like, wow, yes, you are not far from the truth. Well, meanwhile, a lot of things have actually been said onto this, and then it has been gathered that, well, according to Anir Fiok Savior, he has said, well, the most dangerous and wicked dump that you can't head of his voice for anything national matters is Udom, Emmanuel of Aqua Ibom State. No better project in some local areas. Wiki and Autumn are hooks in truth of Buhari's government. Some, some, when I hear about some state governors, I ask if they have passed or present on seats. May God help us from evil ends. All right, and that has been gathered, said by Anir Fiok. All right, and according to him, well, he has just made a very important you note. Know, no statement here. He said the most dangerous and wicked dump that you cannot add of his voice for anything national matters is Udom Emmanuel of Akwai Bomb State. And then I think that actually strikes some point because Udom Emmanuel of Akwai Bomb State, uh, I don't understand. For a very long time, even till now, we don't always hear of him. We have not heard him spoke. He has not said anything and then somebody has just been able to discover that which is very bad you as a governor you just lay low as save early as well and then you are just there embezzling money codedly well that is another serious one i think it needs to be looked looked out for all right that is that and then according to umare salele i said that well these two governors are wicked and ungodly people even the jiwu originated from Togo is an ungodly person who is happy to see Nigerian governor. Nigerian governor wicked 
of River State who cannot allow free and fair election in a state is such a man worthy of emulating. All right. Okay, it's such a man worthy of emulating. He's asking a question. There's a question mark here. Well, the thing is, with what this person has actually said, I don't think this person is an is 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 a friend of good things. So to say, because for all these things that have been happening, see, some people might be you no know, doing wrong in another part, but talking about the agitation, talking about you no know, facing the federal government squarely, I don't think this kind of statement should come in. So some people are just to be suspected because I don't understand. I see no reason why you will state that Adenyoju is is an ungodly person. No, 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 you shouldn't have said that because these people are fighting for a good cause and uh, it's a good one because if, as far as the country is concerned, we just have few people that are actually speaking out. If we do not have people that would speak out, that means a lot of things will go very wrong in this country. So everybody needs to be watchful and be careful. Well, according to Don Juan de Olia, I said that, well, they are weak, according to you, because they have told Buhari to fight insecurity. That is destroying, that is destroying the country. All right, fine. I think somebody has just replied him on that. Okay, another person is actually replying. In fact, a lot of people are replying right now. Okay, fine. This is interesting. Okay, someone say, haha, you make me laugh. So tell us who is good now among them. Okay, and then uh, Frank Uba said that, uh, say no, so no Yoruba governor has spoken out. Very unfortunate. All right, and then um, what of governor from Igbo land? All right, that's another one where, that somebody is talking about. Well, the thing is, uh, speaking out or not speaking out, well, is there a genuine speaking out? Some people will speak out to one level and then um, they will they will like after they must have you no know, given them some bribe they will shut their mouth but we have people that are genuinely speaking out telling out the truth and then that has been the person of you no know, benue state governor governor samuel autumn and then this man had been able to face the buhari government squarely and then uh, he's not scared of anything i think that man should also actually be watchful because they will not like him and they might want to come after him of which they are tr they have tried and uh, they failed well according to godwin norum he has said that mr rabu always speak the truth it will set you free a system that we c we cover the wrongs will not help us all right okay and then Okay, and according to Kash Koka, I said that many of them can't speak up all because of Abuja. Well, it is said that other governors will not talk because of their political interest of being in the good book, the Fulani, for their presidential or vice presidential bid. Those who see and watch the people who elected into office to represent their interest in his constituency, that is, the state being killed and they do nothing about it we know why they do what they do both the pdp and the apc and then that is it we have said this times to that number most of the, these people the reason why they do what they do is because of their own uh, selfish gain selfish interest and there is, it's only god that will bring them down in no time it's just very simple no, they can't continue forever. All the wealth that you are going to acquire, you cannot take it to heaven. So, and uh, that is why God is bigger than man. So any man, any woman being who says is all in all, I want to be this, I want to be that. And uh, ma where majority of people are not happy, where the majority of people are not living well, but you want to be enjoying the whole thing, you will not last. In no time as we speak, in fact, a lot of people have, you no. Know, Rain a lot of causes, and apart from the causes, God is just watching to strike majority of them down any moment, and that is it. Thank God we all know what happened to Abba Kiari. So it's as simple as that. That's the same judgment they will be getting in no time. All right, my people, and that has been it on this one. Me, well, let me have your take on this, and remember to subscribe for more updates. Thanks, and God bless.